60 delegates from across Africa have gathered in Lagos, Nigeria for the Script to Screen project aimed at improving the quality of films coming out of the African continent. The delegates drawn from Nigeria, Kenya, Gambia and Ghana will live together for 28 days working on a project tagged Focus Nigeria. The reality training program will help the filmmakers focus on stories addressing issues bordering on the continent, including migration and poverty, and seek solutions to some of these problems. Well, Script to Screen Africa is a TV reality training program uh, aimed at getting actors and filmmakers together and then we want to train them, work on them to be able to create a revolution. We targeted film as a catalyst for revolution, so it's aimed at building these people and launching them out to be able to create a revolution through filmmaking. The actual sense of the film as a tool is not only just for entertainment, but for social, as a tool for uh, social change. So I feel like um, for the fact that we are trying to use the tool of a filmmaking to entertain people, the key thing beneath the entertainment is for social change. So with the issue of uh, um, young or children growing in Africa, I think um, film as a tool will give us the platform to be able to just uh, put the situation, well address it and even provide solutions on top of the issue that we're discussing tends to highlight, to use filmmaking to highlight um, or bring about changes in Nigeria, which is a very good medium because entertainment is what sells and the best way to imply change is through entertainment. I mean, the, the, the sole purpose is using performing arts, acting, filmmaking to change lives and uh, actually begin to address some of the key issues that we have, the key, the, some of the key problems that we are facing in Africa. For example, corruption, you know, uh, migration, uh, um, and that sort of thing, you know, um, poverty, you know, just few, just to name a few of them. So, uh, Script to Screen is just, it's just one of this platform that has been put in place to make sure that, you know, performers like actors like myself, filmmakers, can use their, their craft to actually sell out this story to the public, you know, to, to the masses, allowing them to actually have a different perspective of what they already know. Sports News Now, Otoa Sega Football Club have defeated Otoa Koti Football Club 1-0 to emerge champions of the 2018 Governor Seriake Dixon Unity Cup or Wea Challenge played in Opume Stadium. The tournament was conceived to get the youths engaged for talent discovery, state and national glory through football. A kickoff by Deputy Governor Boribiwa Jonah preceded handshake formalities at the Opome Stadium, where the final match of the 2018 Governor Dixon Unity Cup Ogbea Challenge was won by Otuasega Football Club after a lone strike in the first half. The initiative of the Commissioner for Information to get the people together to take their minds off from various vices that are youth attracted to, cultism, drug abuse. If this is continued annually, we will go a long way to check the excesses and criminality of youths. It was so maxing, he's a son of the soil, and I still want to commend this young man who has a vision. A vision of development, a vision that will bring the youth and in fact the kingdom together. Governor Seriake Dixon's message is one of peace, unity and development in Ogbea Council area. This is the beginning of the unity in Ogbea. This is a good... A good you know, just, few, just to name a few of them. So, uh, Script to Screen is just, it's just one of this platform that has been put in place to make sure that, you know, performers like actors like myself, filmmakers, can use their, their craft to actually sell out this story to the public, you know, to, to the masses, allowing them to actually have a different perspective of what they already know.